Let's talk about indexing. Indexing involves storing data in a format that speeds up future access or analysis. When dealing with larger data sets, indexing becomes necessary regardless of if your data is stored in an SQL, no SQL, or vector database. Here's a visualization of a collection of vectors numbering in the tens of thousands. And you can imagine in the case of performing similarity search against this collection, you would be waiting an increasing amount of time to search for your match as the amount of vectors in the space continues to grow into the hundreds of thousands or millions. The workaround for this is to group your vectors into clusters called Voronoi regions, and then calculate the vector in each region that is closest to all the others, i.e. you calculate the region centroid. Then when you perform search against the cluster, you will scan the vector space by comparing against only the centroids of each region and not the individual vectors within each region. Once you find the centroid closest to your query, you then compare against all the other vectors in that region to find your closest match. This technique is called inverted file index. While inverted file index may not give you the best match, in practice it achieves a good trade-off between accuracy and speed in cases where speed is more important. Another approach for speeding up search against a large amount of vectors is to approximate the vector space by reducing or compressing the amount of dimensions of the vectors. This technique is called product quantization. If my suspicions are correct, vector search plus an indexing technique like inverted file index or product quantization is what's behind the recommendation algorithm used in production at Spotify. Please correct me if I'm wrong.